Could I ask my honourable friend, does he think it's a good time for an apology from those regional branches of the Police Federation who so traduced our honourable friend, right honourable friend, the member for Sutton Coalfield, yeah, yeah, yeah. and also from the Leader of the Opposition? Let me start by saying, let me start by saying on behalf of the whole House and everyone in the House that we should put on record what an incredible job the police do on our behalf every day, and I see that at very close hand. Uh, and the Leader of the Opposition and I saw that at the Police Bravery Awards uh, last week. But as I said last week, um, the, my own, right, right honourable friend, the, the former Chief Whip, gave a full explanation of what happened. The police in that meeting said that he gave no explanation. And so it is now clear, reading the IPCC report, that the police do need to make an apology. Now, the, the officers concerned and the Chief Constables are coming to the House today, and I hope they'll give a full account and a proper apology to the Home Affairs Select Committee. And it is, as I think, a moment for all of us to consider what we said at the time, and I hope the Leader of the Opposition will do the same thing.